welcome to my channel and for those of you who just subscribed welcome to my channel so today I'm gonna to be doing products that I've hit pan on and that's pretty much what this video is gonna be about so I do have a lot of products um, definitely 10 so I'm just gonna jump right into this it's by NARS and they are the NARS press powders these things oh my goodness I love them so much um, I mainly purchased them because I heard that you can wear them without a foundation and at the time I did not really wear foundation like every day. They go on really really sheer and um, it's definitely buildable because you get a flawless face. Um, you can definitely just keep packing on the color and just get like the most beautiful like application ever. I just love these so much. Um, you can tell because I bought two of them and they are pricey. So um, this one's in Mountain. I bought this when I wasn't that tan yet I guess and this one's like a medium beige color Mountain is and it hit pan and then it cracked and broke and then yeah so this is what's left so I just kept it for this video pretty much and yeah that's that one and then when I started getting tan I got heat and that one's a uh, shade darker so yeah this one's in heat and I definitely hit pan on it and I seriously would use this every day if I could but um, I want to save it because again they are pricey um, also for every single product I mention I will leave them down in the description bar on where you can get it or leave you a link to where you can click it and then it'll pop up and you can purchase it the second one is another press powder and this one's more low-end so low-end it's by elf cosmetics and you can get elf cosmetics at Target but as for this one you can only get it on the elf website and um, these press powders are so adorable so it just comes into like this really black sleek packaging kind of like the NARS ones in a way um, they have like the same texture and then when you open it the formulation of this powder is 10 times different than the NARS ones this one is um, very silky this is really great if you have oily skin just to touch up throughout the day when you open it it has like a hidden little compartment with a little square powder puff which is really great because you never know um, when you're gonna need one especially if you don't want to carry a brush in your purse and in the pan you can tell it looks lighter than my skin tone right now but I swear when you put it on your skin it like sinks in and it magically just like knows what what your shade is because it blends so well and oh my gosh I cannot rave so much about this but it's so inexpensive and that's the best part this is I think three or five dollars I'm not quite sure but I'm in the shade caramel so if you're like in the same color as I am I got caramel or caramel however you want to pronounce it next thing is an elf uh, product as well and it's the complete concealer like complete coverage concealer quad and this is a medium they have it in light medium and dark um, what's great about this is that it comes with like really light shade um, a tan shade uh, like an orangey shade and then like a um, deep dark shade so it's like you can use this for various reasons you can use this quad for blemishes because that's mainly what I used like the one that's closest to my skin tone I'll just like put it over a blemish or for the lighter um, shade you can just put it underneath your eyes to cover your dark circles um, the formulation of this is so creamy and it's definitely buildable as well and the best part it's also cheap and you can get this on the elf website I don't know if I mentioned that but um, I've also raved about this so much and I've hit pan on these three colors. It's a bronzer by NYC and it's the Sun and Bronze Bronzing Powder in Montauk Bronze. This is really great because it comes with three dark shades and two light shades just to get that perfect sun goddess tan. And what I love about this is that it is matte. It has absolutely no shimmer in it. Got to be like my top three most favorite bronzers and that's including high-end bronzers like this one is so great and when you apply it on your skin no joke it makes your skin look like soft like it makes it appear like a really smooth texture okay just a quick little story with this bronzer just to prove to you guys how well it works my face was looking a little pasty that one day and I just applied it like really fast before I went to work I got in the car and my boyfriend was like did you just go to the tanning bed and I was like, no, why? And he's like, oh, you look really tan. Like, no joke, he thought I went to the tanning bed. Just because of this bronzer. It is so great. And I know that they have different shades, so yeah. Um, just 
so amazing. And since we're on the topic of bronzers, I hit pan on this MAC press powder in blunt. This today is still raved about on YouTube, and this was one of my very first MAC purchases. You can put it all over your face, but i rather you guys put this all over your face and then just use this to contour because it's great for any skin tone, honestly. Like, you, if you have light skin, medium skin, dark skin, like, it will show up because you can just keep, like, one swipe and you're good. Or you can just keep applying it and it just gives out the most perfect um, brown contouring shade. I'm wearing it today. I don't know if you guys can tell. But, um, yeah, this, again, was one of my very first MAC purchases. And if you're looking for a good contouring, high-end um, bronzing powder, definitely go with Blunt by MAC. It actually got rubbed off, but this is by Wet n Wild, and it's 348 Starlight Bronze. And I've hit pan about where that dark, deep shade is, and I think I honestly just used to, like, rub a huge brush in here and just apply it all over my face. But <laughs> that was back in the day. I've had this since about high school. And this brown color, I would normally use it for maybe like an eyeshadow, like for a highlight or something. But I fell in love with this really nice gold shade on the end. And it's just a really nice like highlight color. Um, this is really cheap also. Since it's wet and wild, I can't imagine it being more than $3. And since we're on the subject of highlighting, I bought this uh, color cream base by MAC with actually when I purchased Blunt a really long time ago. And this is a cream color base, obviously and it's in shell this is got to be the most beautiful highlighter I have ever purchased like I've never been disappointed um, with this highlighter ever um, I hit pan there in the middle and this it has like a pinky tone to it but it has like silver like in it also like it is just the most gorgeous shade ever um, they have one in pearl but it's more like on the lighter side but this you can use on any skin tone and it will show up um, you can use it like in your tear ducts um, below your eyebrows just for a nice highlight or like on top of your cheekbones down your nose this is so amazing and it will last longer than a powder highlighter just because it's cream based so it really sticks to your skin and it glides on like butter so I'm still in love with it after all these years so um, this is in shell cream color base by MAC. It's by e.l.f. and it's this uh, eyebrow kit in medium. You can get this at Target and I know they have other shades as well on the e.l.f. website. This brow kit is the very first thing that I've ever purchased um, when I wanted to start filling in my eyebrows and I still use it today. I fall in love with it. I trust it. This is my second purchase of this and I've hit pan obviously and the wax part. Um, I only use the wax part just to um, structure my eyebrows and then the more you apply it like fills it in and I don't really use the powder so I don't know but I really love the wax that's inside and it's cute it comes with a little mirror which is adorable and the last two things are eyeshadows this is by NYX and it's one of their trio palettes and it's in Aloha mink brown and deep bronze the color hold on these are so hard to open okay so the color that I hit pan on is the middle one and it's in mink brown this color is great like I have hazel eyes and I just find it to be like the best taupe brown color that it has like a silvery undertone to it so it's really you can use them on any eye color and the formulation of these are so great they are so smooth and they just glide on and it's pretty pigmented like I think after two swipes you'd be done and the very last thing is by Rimmel. I've had this since high school, and um, it's one of the Rimmel quads. It's Smoky Noir, I guess. Um, it's 001. All these colors are great if you want to do, like, the perfect smoky eye. But the color I most lean towards was um, this dark gray color right here because all the other ones are really light, and then it comes with a black and I just fell in love with this medium smoky gray color. So I normally put it like in my crease to like smoke it out and it just gives off the most per like perfect thing and it has no shimmer in it either. It's matte. So you can get this at the drugstore as well. That is all the products that I have. Sorry if that was a lot, but um, I hope this video helped you in any way. Maybe go out and get some of these products and if you do, leave it as a comment below and tell me if you purchased them or um, if you agree with me on any of these products and if you made a video 
on products that you hit pan on. Leave it as a video response below. Until then, I will always see you guys in my next video and have a fabulous rest of your week and I will see you later. Bye.